tempatnya bener ga? Bener orang udah nyampe kan? Ini ya. Oh, iu, enak ya tempatnya ya naturale gitu ya? Naturale sampai mas, Apaan? lu jangan sampai salah lo ya, Mikele lo ya mas. Emang? Lu semua orang dipanggil Bambang, gue aja dipanggil Bambang, Bambang tadi. Bam Bambang versi Itali, ya ya ya. Buongiorno, ciao. We open on 7 December 2020. Sebulan kemudian pandemi ya? Iya, during the pandemic. Iya, eh dia bisa bahasa Indonesia, jadi agak aku jadi Indonesia. Sedikit aja. Ajak makan dong Pak Bambang. Mau makan? Iya, mau makan saya. Makannya jangan jangan nasi campur ya. Bukan bukan di sini kata nasi campur. Bukan gudeg, bukan gudeg. Bukan gudeg. Tapi kalau mau belajar sama saya saya ajar. Rentang bisa. Rendang. I'm joking, I'm joking. Today I gonna show you one of my secret recipe, which is not a secret. It's a tiramisu. Okay, cool. So if you have no time to come here, you can do it at home and you can try and challenge to do it. Okay, hungry, 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 hungry. Let's go. Okay, sekarang sampailah kita mau diajarin untuk membuat tiramisu langsung dari Chef Michele. Michele, Mr. Michele. Kita bikin apa hari ini? Today we gonna show something very simple. So basically, for this Christmas you can do it in your house without many problems. So basically, I'm giving a very old recipe. I'm doing since 1995, 1994, 1995. Was teaching me from an old chef, and you need only simple ingredients. So we are showing the way to make a tiramisu at home without many problems. Because yes. today people they have many recipe. They go to restaurant. They ask in the recipe how I can make it home. Yeah. Now I will show everybody my secret. That's nah, it. Sekarang Mr. Michele itu mau mengajarkan yang paling simple dari uh, tiramisu yang bisa dibuat di rumah. Pasti pengen tahu semua ya. Sesimpel apa sih Mr. Michele? Karena ini sudah all we need. Sulit, ya. All we need yeah. is a sugar, sugar, mascarpone, mascarpone, which you can find in any market in Indonesia. Yeah. Egg. Telur. That's it. Mascarpone is cheese or cream or? The, the mascarpone is made by cream. Okay. Okay. So you boil the cream at uh, uh, a certain temperature, you add some uh, citric acid. Okay. You can do the one. Next next oh. time I'll show you how to make mascarpone at okay. home. So mascarpone is basically cream? It's made by cream. Made by cream yes. to make it like this. Okay, yes. okay. Yeah. So, but uh, at, we, we, it take a bit quite longer, so it's better you buy in the supermarket. It's, it's easy, you can find anywhere in Indonesia, so that's it. I don't want people around when I'm doing this. Oh. Please, I suggest you to go sit down and have a nice coffee. I love we have a nice oh, coffee yes, here. Yes, yes. Espresso? Espresso, cappuccino, Gino. long black, whatever you want. Kalau sudah di restoran Itali, jangan lupa itu yang namanya cappuccino sama espresso. Uh, itu langsung seger. Saya itu kalau minum ini, langsung 17 tahun mukanya nih. Seperti saya, kita kena kena espresso. Lihat-lihat ya, 17 tahun kan? Kalau <laughs> saya sih cuma minta melek aja. Ah, uh, Ah, this is another things which is the biscuit, which is a Savoyardi. You can so find in any market in Indonesia. Oh. Uh, so it's okay. Ini <coughs> boleh dimakan begini? Ya, boleh dimakan. Boleh, boleh dimakan. Coba. Oh, kamu boleh. mau coba? coba. coba. Bisa. Mau coba, mah bilang aja aku mau coba. Boleh nggak? Pakai ngebulat sana, ngebulat sini. Rasanya kayak apa sih? <laughs> Aduh, mau dong. Hmm, enak ya. Rasanya tuh nice to meet you. Good bye. <laughs> go, go, go. Go have your coffee. Come on, come on. This one, one more, one more. Yeah, one more. Okay. This is espresso? This is espresso. The one yes. you're gonna drink now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Thank you, Mr. Miguel. Thank you. Go, 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 go. Hello to everybody from Mike Pizza. My name is Michele, and now I will make you understand how the tiramisu is done. Okay. 
It's very simple, all you need, one of these, which you, I'm sure you have it in your house. I, I need to precise that uh, I'm not gonna use a glove. Usually here, when we do it in my restaurant, we do it, uh, this preparation, we, we need to wear a glove. But since you are making your house, I saw you a simple way to do it without glove. First of all, you don't know how to separate the egg. Don't worry, you just do this. Open. Put inside. You are using your hand to get one. I need to press inside the egg that I already wash it. By your hand, see? Two. Without broken the yellow. See? Three. Four. Eight. For five to six people, you just need eight egg, no more than that. Okay? There we go. Now, here we have eight egg. I'm not using a uh, timbangan scale or anything. I'm using only one spoon. One egg, one spoon. Simple, full one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? Now, you have the white. First of all, you need to form in the white. So we put everything inside in a big cup. I add the vanillin. This is a vanillin essence to the white egg. Just see, I'm not using misuration, just a bit. Perfecto. And then, here we go. Maximum speed. Okay, you make it very firm, make sure that it's quite firm, it's no more liquid. All you have to do, okay, let me put this one like this. You take this one and you keep it in a chiller. And um, normal chiller, four degree, five degree, just to make it a bit firm. Just a second, I'll be back. Here we go. I put the white egg in the chiller and now we are going to the next step. What, uh, the egg and the sugar. Look at the color of the egg, it's a yellow color. We need to melt basically the sugar. What we're doing with the mixer, we caramelize the sugar. So we melt the sugar, we increase the temperature, and so the, the color will change. The secret is to stop when the egg is no more yellow, but a bit creamy color. Let's go. All right, see, the color is already changed from yellow to creamy. And this is the signal that the egg is ready. All the sugar is melted. Make sure that all the egg is firm, right? All right. Here we go. Stop for a second. Now look, all you have to do, look. This is the egg and the sugar. And what we're gonna do with this? Basically, mascarpone cheese. This one is 250 gram for eight egg and 10, eight uh, spoon of sugar. Just put it inside, it's, see it's quite firm. Again, 
this time don't go too fast just slow if you ever with a slow motion you can do it if you know it never mind no it's not a big deal and we're gonna melt the mascarpone inside ready here we go okay let's see the consistency perfetto now I suggest to put this one for at least 10 minutes in a chiller and then you mix with a white egg okay now let me put this one in a chiller I come back in a second there we go done is it chill out I go and get the white egg, I'll be back. There we go. This is the white egg. Very slowly, because we don't need to broken this one. We're gonna put all the on top. Perfect. Looks so nice and creamy. See, you can see that the cream stay on top of the white means that the white already firm and it's ready to be mixed. Perfetto. There we go. Never mind. All right. Now, slowly, you start from the bottom and put on top like this. Slowly, slowly, without broken the white egg. When it's well done, all nice mix, like this, Okay. Put another 20 minutes inside the chiller to firm a bit. Okay, I'll be back. Vicenza, sempurna dalam keanggunan. Now, what do you have to do? You have the containers for the cake. You make sure you have a cocoa powder. I'm using for tiramisu a vanilla essence. Usually if in your house you don't want to have alcohol, you just put, no vanilla essence, sorry, this is a rum essence, which is not alcohol, it's just the essence of rum. So it's without alcohol, but here we are doing with the alcohol. Coffee. Yeah, perfect. All you have to do, and pour the coffee inside a plate like this perfetto you put uh, a little bit of rum essence which is enough this is very strong one you can find in any market here in indonesia you mix very well okay but you can use any kind of uh, alcohol like a whiskey rum anything so it doesn't matter here we go now, there we go. put first a layer of tiramisu. Savoyardi, inside. You will see that the Savoyardi will absorb the coffee very fast. You twist very fast. Put a little bit of coffee, you don't pour all the coffee. So, it won't broken. All right, and put inside. There we go. Sedikit mm. lagi. Rum. Okay. Ten more. It's the right portion. Now. We're gonna put more cream on top. Now, it depends on you, how much big is your, how big is your container. You can make one layer. Actually, like this is already good, but I like bigger, I like thick tiramisu. So, there we go, right? Okay.
three and four. Now, there we go. Perfecto. Always gentle. There we go. Done it. Some tissue. To do what? Perfect. Hmm? Because you want to wrap it with the plastic wrapper, so, or maybe with the, the cover, uh, the plastic cover. I have one. Let me get one plastic cover, I'll show you. How. Because when you put in a chili, you do want the tiramisu to absorb some other flavor, so it's better to have the something to cover. And this, uh, this nice plate was provided by the Gallery Rasa and Gendel. Can you clean a bit? Get the plastic container to cover it. There we go. Cover it and put in a chiller for at least one hour to let it firm, become cold, consolidated, and then enjoy the tiramisu. Merry Christmas. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, now we are showing another dishes, which is uh, one of our famous dishes here in my pizza, which is the linguini marinara. First, crumbati. We add the pasta straight from the water. And we're going to bake all around with the scissor. You can use it by the, also the knife. Okay, and here we go. Vlogers, terima kasih ya sudah selalu menonton Galeri Rasa Channel Masak Sempurna dengan Vicenza. Jangan lupa di subscribe kalau mau lihat video-videonya masih banyak yang ada di sini. Tuh bisa dilihat ya.